Hey everyone, if you guys have been following my channel, you know that I, I just got these Fostex headphones and uh, I just got these Deconi replacement ear pads for the Fostex and I love these ear pads as far as comfort and they didn't change the uh, sound signature too much as far as bass and but they did add in more sound stage and like more dy dynamic sound over the stock headphones but they're and they're like way 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 more comfortable than than the stock headphones that um came with these Fostex and in my never ending mod we're going to take a look at this thing right here with what's in here so these are the going to be the replacement ear pads hopefully so let's just open it up. Hopefully, um, I didn't open this yet because I didn't know, because it didn't come in a box like the Coney. So I didn't know if it was going to be um, just <laughs> the ear pads in here. So let's find out. Okay. So here it is. These are the, these are called the Sisson Upgraded Replacement Memory, memory Foam Ear Pad Cushions. And they, they fit a lot of headphones. It had Fostex in there when I looked at it. And you can get them on Amazon for $16.99. So I guess this is all it comes in. It's just a Ziploc bag. Clear Ziploc bag. And then right there is the, uh, the name. See? serial number and then it says the name upgraded replacement and see for supposed to be for Sennheiser sure and it says Fostex so um let's just open it up I don't know if these are gonna go with my Fostex though because these are a different shape look at this which Fostex are they talking about It seems like it's got a lot of padding, just like my Deconis, but man, in the pictures, it looked round, and this is like oblong. Let's try one of them out, see if they fit. So I'm going to take off the left ear pad right here and see. These are one of those angled padding ear pads, but why is it a different shape other from what I saw? Hmm. Let me see. I'm gonna try to put it on, see if it works. Okay, we're back. So I had to stop the recording and just uh, do it off camera because these things were um, pretty tight to put on. Like it seemed like they were smaller than the, the Deconi pads that were made specifically for these uh, Fostex um, T series, uh, RP series, TRP series of headphones. But as you can see, it's on now. Um, and uh i did try it out it feels very comfortable it's got a lot of padding it, it's angled so one part is like more has more padding than the other side it's one of those angled memory foam pads i've never really used the the angled type of of pads but comfort seems pretty good i mean these are comfortable too and this is these feel just as comfortable i don't really notice a difference in comfort so now the final thing i have to do is uh listen to some songs on these and see if uh it changed the uh sound signature or you know the sonic differences like uh, if it changed the bass and the treble and all those other frequencies so let me get back with you guys on that 
Okay, so we are back. And um, I tested it out with a, a few different songs that I normally listen to when I test out headphones. And um, I'm happy to say that uh, it doesn't sound that much different. And I had to go back and forth between the Deconis. So... Isolation, sound isolation, I thought was better on these versus the Deconis. And that's saying a lot because the Deconis have very good isolation and comfort. But I think it's just because of the material. Um, this is velour, soft velour. While this is like a artificial leather. So maybe artificial leather has better isolation than velour so the base and the, on these compared to these are roughly about the same same thing with the uh sound stage that I, I didn't notice too much of a difference although i do noticed maybe the deconis might give you a little bit more highs but they're they're pretty they're pretty close very very close so i wouldn't i would not say that uh these the deconi sound better than the uh sensen sensen what is this uh the sensen sensen yeah and uh you know other than the first part where i thought these were too small and it was a tighter fit to put on over the deconi's um, that's the only one issue that I had was that these were tighter to fit around, but these, uh, Sisson, they have, they have more of this lip right here going down and that's probably what made them tighter. Whereas the Deconis, um, their, the lip is probably what you could say perfect for the, uh, Fostex TRP series. So that's that, but the Deconi only came in black. But the Deconi does have the ones that are like protein leather and then velour right here on the inside, uh, like a hybrid type. I forget what they call their, their hybrid series um, of um, ear pads. But anyways, that's pretty much it. Uh, I do recommend them. Just as long as you know what you're getting as far as um, when you're going to install these. That's the hardest part was the installation. They were pretty tight. But I'm pretty sure if I, when I switch back and forth. Um, <clears throat> they're going to get easier and easier to, to put on. Like I said. only the, These are made for like so many different headphones. Like your Sennheisers. Your uh, Audio Technicas. And um, others. So... They had to make sure it would fit for all those other headphones. While well, these Deconis were made specifically for the uh, Fostex um, T50, T20s, and 30 uh, T40s um, RPs headphones. So that's why the fit was, as far as like putting them on, was easier. But all in all, I, I have nothing too bad or negative to say. The sound signature... It's pretty similar to the Deconis, and they're both way better than the uh, the stock ear pads that came with um, with the Fostex, which were these little these little thinner than pancake um, ear pads. And these, if you get the replacement, they're like almost eighty bucks, like sixty nine or seventy nine dollars, something like that for for these little. For these little pancakes right here you know other than you know the presentation i mean it just comes in this plastic bag not not even no labeling except for there on where the serial number is or the barcode so yeah they're highly recommended i recommend them that you can get them on amazon it just depends i guess on which days so when i got these it had the prime uh two day delivery but now i'm looking at it it doesn't seem like it has it it comes in four colors 
you get black, white, blue, and red. I might get the red, I'm not sure. If they had orange, it would be ideal because it would match this and this uh, cabling right here. And then the Fostex name is in orange also. And if you look at Fostex website, it's all orange and black is their theme on their website. So anyways, this is the Sin, 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 S Y N S E N upgraded replacement memory foam ear pad cushions for all types of headphones. Um, for large, maybe extra large headphones or ear pads, you can get them for your Audio Technicas, what they have them Brainwaves, uh, Hi Fi Man, Philips, Sony. Sennheiser, Shure, Fostex, and Koss headphones. They are $16.99. And like I said, it depends on the day that you get them, whether you'll get Prime, same day, two day delivery or not. And they, uh, they come in four colors. This is the white one, but they also have black, blue, and red. So that is about it. If you guys got any value, from this video please like and subscribe follow me on instagram at the workout geek for all my latest happenings and great workout tips till next time everybody take care stay safe stay healthy and we will see you soon for another video have a great day